Well, I brought you word about competition and market authority involvement with regard to getting the fuel prices down. It appears, of course, that that's not the only place they're sticking their ore into. It's got some effect on food as well. Everybody, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're doing all right. I'm not too bad, not too bad. Let me know how you are in the comments and thank you for your support for the channel, by the way. It really means the world. We are really doing good. Uh, that All the numbers are growing, subscribers, views and everything. I think we've done just over a million views in the last 28 days. It's incredible. And at that rate, we're going to uh, explode, I think. We're, uh, we're getting there, we're getting there. One of the things I like to do is keep you well informed or as well informed as I can about prices and consumer stuff and all the rest of it. Well, what we want to look at today is the price of products within the shops, namely Sainsbury's. And I do have to wonder how much involvement the CMA have actually had, because we know we've got farm to fork where, uh, you know, supermarket executives have been dragged in front of Downing Street, giving them a shake, saying, come on, you've got to sort it out. And things are starting to happen. Now, Sainsbury's, uh, have slashed the price of 40 of their own brand products. Now you go in, you've got yogurt, cheese, bread, butter, all, all sorts of stuff right across the board. And you know, these 40 products, they've slashed some of them by as much as 60%. And that's a hell of a jump. I mean, it could mean pennies in some cases, but pennies to a lot of people can certainly add up. Now some of the examples, I have to put my glasses back on again, because I'm going blind. Uh, fat-free natural yogurt, uh, it was a pound, it's now down to 40p. I eat loads of the stuff, especially for breakfast. Uh, soft cheese was two pound, now one pound 20. Cottage cheese, 185, now 130. Double cream, uh, double cream, 130, now 115. A mild cheddar, a 400 gram block, so quite a lump, 370, now 340. And, you know, that's just the tip of the iceberg. The list goes on and on and on. There's absolutely loads of products. Now, if Sainsbury's are going to start doing it, I wonder whether you've got Tesco's, Asda's, uh, Morrison's and all the rest. Are they going to start coming down to keep pace too? I hope so, because it will be good news. And, you know, we've already had news of things like pasta and bread, their own branded stuff there coming down too. Might mean we might afford a little bit more. Are you struggling? Are you all right? Or, you know, uh, let me know what your situation is. You imagine to get everything you need. And what do you think of this news? Fingers crossed, it's a step in the right direction. Anyway, I'm off. I'll see you shortly with one more. Toodaloo.